on everyone, it's your good RC Carl 25 here. Like always, thanks for watching and welcome to part seven of the Samson Tugboat Build Project. Now, before I get on with the whole build video part, I wanted to get on here and talk a little bit about a few things. A few little issues I ran into while installing the parts. One of the issues I ran into was installing the dry shaft. Now, in the pictures of the instructions, the dry shafts were connected. So here's the dry shaft. And at the end of the dry shaft right here, it's supposed to be this little T-knuckle ordeal. That this hooks on here, that hooks into the motor, which turns the shaft. So yeah. Well, they had theirs already together, as you see here, and we have separate parts. So I was trying to figure out, well, how does this go into this? And I figured out, well, there's a little flat edge right here, so that flat edge has got to go to something. So inside the little connector piece here is the groove. The matching pieces. So all you do is put it in there, push down, it locks in place and there you go. You got the shaft. So that was the easy fix. Now the next issue I ran into was installing the rudder system to the servo. Nowhere instruction says how to go about doing that. Nowhere in the video shows how to do that. They show it in the video already hooked together but they didn't say exactly how and it didn't send any kind of connections to connect the rudder to the servo so I had to figure a way out to do that and actually one of my subscribers here on the channel uh, mentioned me about it because he's actually building the fishing trawler from Latin craft which is where I got the tugboat from and I actually own that one as well see there's Latin craft uh, fishing trawler and I'll be starting that build here soon but first I got to get this one done before I start that one but he asked me did I figure a way out of doing it and I said yeah uh, it took me a little time, I had to order some parts for it, so I wanted to talk about those parts. Uh, both of these parts are from Aquacraft models. First one is AQUB8764 rudder steering arm for the Rescue 17 fire boat. The next one is, <coughs> excuse me, AQUB8765 rudder linkage with Easy Z Connect for the Rescue 17 fire boat, which is my fire boat that I own right up here, right there. So I ordered those parts, they came in, and then I had to go out to my uh, local hardware store and get a rod, a little steel rod, to connect the rudder to. And there you go, see? Ooh, there we go. Now I seen in the tutorial video they were using this little wooden stick, but you know, again, there's no way of connecting that stick to a servo. Now, that was another issue. How was I going to get the connection piece to the servo? Now, that was an easy solution. All right. Well, the servo arm that I ordered was too long. So I actually had to cut it down because it was hitting the back of the bow of the boat. So I had to cut it down, drill a hole, and make for the connection part. If you can see that, I don't know, it might focus, focus. Not on me, come on, focus over here. There, well, there we go, okay, it was pretty much, all right. So, I got that piece on there, fit perfect and everything. Now, my question was how I was gonna get this piece to hook to the servo so it can move. Easy solution. All I did was use a paper clip. Unfold the paper clip, get out what how, how many linkage I need, cut it, and here it is. So if you can see it, da, da, da. there you go. And all I did, make a little hook, and all you gotta do is connect it to the servo like so. And oh yeah, connection right there. So pretty easy. And I'll show you in a video of installing and all that stuff. So yeah, so with no further ado, let me stop talking about everything and let you see the video. Now I do want to say also, I'm not done with the painting process. I have to go back and add a sealer and paint the inside of the hole. So I'm just waiting for a clear day to do that because right now it's been raining and winding and all that kind of stuff is going on. All right, so yeah. All right, well, uh, if you guys got any questions about this project build, Please comment down below and make sure you check out my Facebook page for the channels, uh, facebook.com forward slash LRCCrawl25, and I'll see you guys later.